So I just got back from work and there was a parcel left for me. And that's coming from a fan in Ontario. Somebody who I've been talking with back and forth about curiosities and curio collecting and how to clean bones and take care of bodies and things like that. So anyway, she used a lot of tape on it, which is really good. It's good to see somebody who likes to use tape as much as I do. Are you going to go outside, Callie? Come on. So we're going to very carefully open this because it does say all over the box, fragile, handle with care. So we might be here for a couple minutes trying to open the box. Hi. Yes, Snowflake. So here is the return address. I'll just set that there. Let's see. There's a little card in the bottom. Oh, that's cute. Little raccoon. Thank you for taking the time to help me with CT and getting him to where he is now. I could not have done it without you. I got this for you because CT is a raccoon and it seemed appropriate as a gift. It is a real skull from a sustainable source and it died of natural causes here in Canada. I do not know its gender sadly, but that leaves some fun for you. I used blue and green like I did on CT, but I added the branches and the purple to make it unique. Thank you once again for your help with CT and taking time out of your busy schedule to talk about him and other related projects. So this is absolutely beautiful. It's a beautiful, beautiful specimen. Thank you so much. I have no idea what to say other than that. Thank you. <laughs> I will put this little fella in a very special place.